Okay, give me a sec. What is up, guys? Major Magpie here, and welcome back to Dying Light. Uh, in the last episode, we just finished off doing Spike's missions. Uh, and we've now got to go and talk to Spike. Right, let's go and see Spike. I'm guessing it's back to that little place beside the tower block. I'm gonna try and loot a little bit more and uh, get a load of uh, materials. Just have a new one of it so we can build some better weapons. Zorba's there. It's nice I can't loot vehicles. Hey Spike! It means air drop. Crane, first of all, you did great out there. From now on, if you need something, come see me. And to start with, use a UV flashlight and a remote control. You run up on a volatile, give him a face full of UV, or lead him into a trap which you can trigger with that remote. You got it? Got it. Perfect. Now for the bad news. Despite your efforts, Brecken's mission failed. Ah, oh, shit. Is he okay? He's alive. But you need to get back to the tower. Jay called all Learned the scouts in, flares. and that means you. You just picked up a blueprint, search components. Okay. There's nothing else in here. Um, okay, so we need to go back to the tower. Hey! Bye, guys. For some reason, I don't have to put the tower, but I go over here. Make sure I remember to do me looting. Up on the roof. Let's 
two boxes. It's not too much. There it is. Let's get them. Let's go in the wrong way. So we need a. to have a meeting with the tower's leader. Acknowledged. Confirm his identity and contact us immediately. More blades, some batteries. Open this. Hey, what a surprise. More coffee. It's a strange place to keep your coffee really when you're thinking about it. Let's go and see Bracken then. The old chief. It's our man now. Yeah, this is unmanned. Hey man, I'm alive. <laughs> Still not falling. What a master. That pay for these then. If it must provide you with free items each day, make sure you visit him. Ah, right. So. Cool. I'll just keep taking everything here as well. Right? right. Hey. <laughs> Let's keep some crap. Um, okay, we'll go up and see. Brecken. Brecken's mission failed. Jade called a meeting in the tower. It's my opportunity to finally meet with Brecken and confirm his identity. Listen, Brecken and a team of runners went after an airdrop last night. He lost the rest of his team to biters, and then Riser's men ambushed him, beat him to a pulp, and stole the drop. Now Brecken wants to go after the next drop himself, but we can't let him, and you've got to back me up, okay? For God's sake! You can't even walk straight! We need you alive, you idiot! Okay, we're going in. Act confident. Brecken? Lena? Maybe you can get through to him. Jade, who's your friend? Kyle Crane. Look, Brecken, the last thing we need is for you to go back out there. We can figure out another way without jeopardizing you. Right, Crane? I'll go. I'll do it. Right? Yes. Crane will go. He'll be happy to. Jesus. No offense, friend, but you're as green as grass. You can't just... Crane will manage. He'll start in the right spot. And Lena's right. You need to be here taking care of the towers, convincing them the world's not over yet. Oh, hell. Maybe one more try before we go to Rice. Yeah. Okay, fine. Good luck, Crane. 
Jade. A moment. Sure. Head for the cauldron. I'll be in touch shortly. Look, there's something else we need to discuss. Brecken was hurt pretty bad out there. Worse than he wants people to know. He took a blow to the head. Now he's starting to have seizures, and I don't have any Lora tracks. Yeah, I doubt anyone does. Anti-seizure drugs were being passed out like candy when the infection first started. And the stores ran out weeks ago. Yes, that's right. How do you know that? Look, what do you need me to do, Lena? There's a man in town named Ghazi. He's not altogether there, if you know what I mean. His mother had epilepsy, so he used to pick up medicine for her each month. She died two years ago. But Ghazi kept going to the store to pick up her prescription. He likes his routine, and Ghazi can be very insistent. So they kept giving it to him. You think he's been stockpiling it all this time? If he hasn't, I don't know where else we're going to get it from. Ghazi lives under the overpass. And don't mention his mother's death. He won't understand. New journal on his mother's death. Cool. Uh, let's go. Oh, there's loads of exclamation marks on the map as well now. So what do they mean? Um, all up or down, or on a different floor. Another shop. Another look on the next floor. Hey guys, that's a crack at Latin. What's going on here? Bayer's locked himself in the room. We could hear him screaming. He may have turned. You hear that? I can't get this lock. You want to try it? I can do it. Right. Okay. Hello, Bahir. Nope. Look in your house first. Yeah. Got anything worth having? Where the hell is he? I need him to his house. I can't even look in his fridge. Where is he? Hello? My like or something. Hello, man. Tell me what's wrong. I can't move. My chest feels like it's going to explode. Are you turning? No, no. I took antizin and the pain started. The vial is on the floor. What you took is junk. What? It's fake. Where did you get this from, Bahir? Please. I need a doctor. First, tell me who sold you that. I can't, I promised. This guy is very useful. He, he brings me things from the outside. Yeah, like phony antizin? People could be giving this to their kids. You want them to go through this? No, God, no. Then tell me who sold it to you. Yusuf. He's one of the scouts. He lives on the roof. Okay, I'll get Dr. Lena. Naughty Yusuf. Oh, please, hurry! So while I'm here, have you got uh, anything I can take up here? No? Can I read your fridge yet? Can't. Never mind. Okay. What happened? Did you kill him? What? No. Look, he's not turning, but he needs a doctor. I thought he was turning. We should still keep an eye on him. If he needs a doctor, you should get the doctor. <laughs> You're a genius, you. Hello. 
If he needs a doctor, you should get a doctor. You're not a doctor. Uh, you want to chat like Mr. Dawood? Look, I've got to get out of here. I need to get my wife and kids somewhere safe. You know, it seems to me this is about the only safe place there is. <sighs> Safest place in the slums, maybe. But the slums aren't safe. It's no place for my family. And I found a way out. You mean out of the slums? I can't tell you the details, but I need to get across town, and I can't do it without a gun. If you'll get me one, I'll tell you about a place that hasn't been looted yet. I promise you won't regret it. Well, how do you know this place hasn't been looted? Because there's only one person that has access to this place, and you're looking at him. Bring me a gun, and the key is yours, as well as everything you find there. Oh, I could just kill you and take the key. And probably not find it. That's probably not the wisest idea. Never oh, mind. Uh, okay, so I need to stop taking on mission. That's some stash of stuff. Oh, yeah. We need to go down or up? I'm not sure. Down. It's down. We're looking for the doctor. Hey, dude. Hold X to ride the elevator down. With most of the runners out of action, Brecken wants the scouts to take their place. That means me. We're supposed to go for the next airdrop right before sunset. Jade will be showing me the ropes. Now that won't be awkward at all. Alright, looks like we'll leave the side missions for the time being and we'll uh We'll try and press on with the main mission. We need to go and contact the GRE. Right. So we need to get up high to get a signal. Radio? Okay, yeah. Uh. Crane here. Report. Tower boss is named Brecken, and he's definitely not your man. The other likely suspect is this warlord, basically. Local guy. Calls himself Rise. He's hoarding Antizen and then gouging the hell out of anybody who wants to buy some. I'm on a mission to get Antizen from the airdrop. If I don't succeed, they'll have to come up with something else. Acknowledged. Good job, Crane. You're doing well. Stay on task, and we'll be in touch. Be sure to call us immediately if and when you get that Antizen. Okay. This way I'm here. Got string. Open. Stairs. That's not a lockpick, it's just an opener. Coffee? Yay, of course there is. Can't open this door for whatever reason, so. House is looted, might as well get out of here. Right. Looking for.
Eu não assustava nada, não. É, right, ok. So, look for the airdrop and the cold run area. Probably gonna be a good idea to take this on the next episode. Alright guys, I think it's a good idea to pick this up in the next one. Uh, fancy it's going to be quite a long mission. So, we will do that. Uh, we've been kind of sidetracked a little bit in this one, you know, trying to pick up other tasks and then ended up doing the main one anyways. Uh, we'll have to try not to do that in the future, because it can get a little bit confusing at times. Uh, so, next episode we'll crack on with the main storyline and then maybe do a couple of the side missions, providing they're not too long. Uh, I don't know, I've got to go and see uh, Yusuf on the roof uh, as one of the side missions. And also that other fella um, who claims to have the, the secret stash that nobody's looted anymore. He wants a gun, which I haven't even come across yet myself. So, uh, that one can just be done as and when we start getting it on. Uh, but, until the next episode, uh, thanks a lot for watching and... See you in the next one.